We're going to go through the basic instructions on how to level the door gap on the top of the door. These instructions are the same whether it's a one door cabinet or a two door cabinet. You can find more detailed instructions at www.howardmiller.com. As you can see from this cabinet, it has a tighter gap on the hinge side and a larger gap as it grows out to the lock side. This is caused primarily by one of two reasons. One is the floor leveling guides on the bottom of the product are not all the way in. The second potential problem is that the surface of the floor is uneven. Using an assistant to tip the product back, what you want to do is put all the floor levelers into their utmost position. Set the cabinet back down. If your cabinet is similar to this, where you have a larger gap on the lock side and a smaller gap on the hinge side, what you want to do next is have your assistant tip the cabinet back, lower the hinge side leveler approximately three to four turns until such time that the lock side leveler is no longer touching the floor. Once you've done that, assess your gap and see if the situation is resolved. If it is, what you want to do is lower the other levelers so they're just snug to the floor. If that did not adjust the level of the door, repeat the same process. Slightly tip the cabinet back, lower the hinge side leveler such that it releases the lock side lever from the floor, assess your gap, and snug the other three levelers to the floor.